Yo, what up, YouTube? This is Sergio45 with another video, and today we're going to be talking about how people should consider to stop becoming so offended, add value to your life, and add value to other people's lives at the same time. And here's an example of that. Oftentimes, people become engaged in a conversation, and at some point in time during the conversation, somebody will say something that the other person perceives as offensive. And what happens is, is typically you get two responses. One, one of two responses. One is the outward approach where it's more like uh, verbally combative. And then the other one would be the inward uh, response, which is more like, you know what? I can't believe this person just said that. I'm just done listening. Either way, uh, you're getting tuned out. And in order to prevent that uh, from the person who gets offended, um, I think that oftentimes we need to step back and realize that other people – pretty much never say anything without reason. So there's always a reason behind something that somebody says. And um, I've been working on this a lot myself, especially towards the end of 2018. And, uh, you know, I call it like my late year's resolution and I'm still running with it. Basically, anytime somebody is talking, is saying something to me and I start to become offended or I can feel myself starting to become offended, uh, what I do is I tell myself while still attempting to listen to them, uh, don't be offended. Don't be offended. Don't be offended. And what I found that as I've, uh, as I've done that, I've been able to calm down and kind of grasp better, uh, what somebody's saying rather than, and learn from it and grow from it rather than being offended. And, uh, oftentimes what I do is, is after doing that, if I don't understand what somebody's saying, I just ask them, what do you mean? You know, in a nice, calm, uh, voice. Also, another thing after that, I may ask him is, how do you mean that? And as they explain it to me, I'm like, okay, you know what? I understand better. Um, but, you know, add value to your life by uh, not becoming so offended because oftentimes when people are saying something, they're saying something from their own experience and it's something that you can grow from. Here's an example. I used to live in Germany and when I lived in Germany, I had a boss that you all may know as, uh, her name is, on, uh, is it's me, Den de la Bella. Hey, it's me. Right. Um, but anyway, uh, I, sometimes I get pulled into her office and uh, we would have what we called or what she called teaching moments. Right. Or learning lessons for me. And uh, not every time, but sometimes when she'd be speaking to me, I'd find myself becoming offensive, offended. And what I've learned is that uh, in that mo in those moments that I was offended, I kind of stunted my professional growth. And you can do this person in your personal growth, uh, growth and maturity as well. But this is what I mean. Uh, instead of just listening and growing from what she was uh, attempting to teach me, um, you know, I, I oftentimes people's responses would be to shut somebody out, right? Oh, I don't want to listen to this. And in my profession, you, you kind of have to listen and, and drive on, you know, like, okay, got you, understood, whatever, got you, right? Um, but I look back on, on things she may have said maybe a year ago, a year and a half ago, two years ago, three years ago now, and I wish that I had listened to her in that moment because I would have grown then uh, and matured professionally. And then also a lot of those things you can apply to your uh, personal life. And an example of, uh, of a personal thing would be um, like last night, I was riding around with my father. We we're about to go have dinner uh, and meet some people and go have dinner. And uh, I was explaining something to him and I was ex excited about it. And he said something and I re reacted almost like I was disrespected. And I wasn't, and I didn't mean to react that way. However, he was like, hey, look, man, uh, you know, I, I'm not trying to be disrespectful. And I explained to him how I didn't take it disrespectfully. But my, you know, looking back on it, the way I reacted, it, it, it definitely perception based. You know, you could have been like, oh, well, Sergio felt disrespected, right? One thing that I have uh, uh, learned, though, um, by this is that everything, like I said, everything that people say is, is to help you grow, uh, to help you learn people who care about you. And there are definitely, please don't get it, uh, misunderstood. There are, I definitely agree that there are things that people should never say that are definitely offensive, right? But not the vast majority of people. I don't think they mean to, uh, be offensive, right? Everything's meant to, not everything, but most things are meant to teach you and to help you grow from it. And then also a lot of times, you know, when it comes the older people looking at me, this is just how I feel. You know, they feel like they can't say anything to, to younger people, right? Especially younger people, right? Oftentimes you get the response like, you know, you did well here, 
But here you need to, you know, improve, da 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 da, and all this stuff. They always have to tell you, you know, I don't mean it this way, but, you know, like, no, that just takes away from the learning experience, in my opinion, right? Um, so it's, it's, sometimes it can be kind of embarrassing. Um, but yeah, I mean, basically, that's just what I mean. And I, I hope that whoever watches this video can use it and kind of comprehend what I mean. Oh, this is, this is another thing. While you're adding value to yourself and growing in the moment, you can also add value to other people, and this is how. While you, instead of becoming offended, you take what somebody else is saying and grow and learn from it, right? You can pay it forward. You can pay it to the next person and help prevent them, hopefully, from uh, making a mistake and falling on their face, no matter how big or how small, right? And helping them grow um, personally and professionally, whether it be at work or at home or just in, 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 in public or with your friends or whatever, right? You can help somebody grow from something that somebody else taught you. And like I said, prevent them from falling on their face, whether it be financially or legally or, or, or whatever, you know, you can help somebody and that, you know, that's important. Um, extremely important to help other people. And that's something that I also would love to see more in society. But anyway, um, yeah, stop being so offended, you know, listen to people. And if you don't understand them, ask them what they mean, grow from what they have to say. And then you make an educated decision. You know what? I don't want to listen to this person and that's cool, but at least you gave them an opportunity to explain themselves. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so basically that's it for me. And uh, I hope you enjoy this video and uh, tell me what you think in the comments based off of my opinions uh, of what I'm saying as far as people being offended all the time. I know that I've grown from attempting to not become uh, be so offended um, uh, often, as often as I had been in the past. Uh, and then also I know I mentioned um, the, the Dindela uh, Bella. And uh, definitely go subscribe to her channel, right? Subscribe to mine, but definitely go subscribe to her channel. Help her grow. She's uh, She used to be my boss, but she's a really good friend of mine now, and I want to help her grow too. I'd love to see her uh, succeed and, and um, be able to help uh, add more blessings to her life and to also to her family's life. And then also, I reached this week 150 subscribers, which is like super huge for me, right? So uh, I'm over, I'm, I think I'm at 151 right now. So one thing I want to say to my, and, and thank you for that, right? But I want to say to my 150th subscriber, I want to say, gracias, Carlitos, por ser uh, mi 150th <laughs> suscriptor. <laughs> I still don't, no sé cómo a de ser uh, 150th en español, pero no problema, ¿por qué? Me entiende, me entiende. <laughs> uh, but anyway, no, thanks for subscribing. Keep that up. Subscribe more. I appreciate everything that everybody does. Uh, watching my videos. Uh, I hope you learn something from them, and I hope we continue to grow together. So anyway, that's it for me. Everybody have a great night. Later.